Well, howdy y'all, Handy Redneck here. It's, uh, oh, it's either the 15th or the 16th of February. Uh, there's about six to eight inches of snow outside, and everyone uh, is freaking out about keeping warm. And I keep seeing these uh, DIY little um, pots with uh, flower pots with candles under them as heaters. And I'm going to show y'all uh, the prepper's way, which is actually the old way of uh, keeping things going. Uh, this, this thing here in front of me, in front of y'all, is what's known as a hurricane lamp. I got this one uh, on sale for about seven dollars. Oh, about six or seven years back. They're running about twenty dollars now. Uh, they come in pieces. Got the tower and the oil reserve with a wick in it and uh, an adjuster with a wick. Well the interesting thing about uh, these here hurricane lamps is they run off of lamp oil and as you can see here it says for indoor or outdoors this lamp oil. Um, for the price of the lamps and the lamp oil you can buy them and put them in storage for years and then when something like the power goes out or and it's winter and it gets cold uh, you got them so I just shut the main power to where we're working off and I'm going to show you this here you light it up and you adjust the flame down put the glass chimney on and you adjust the flame a little more you, you want the flame adjusted where it's not producing smoke otherwise it, it'll blacken up your um, chimney and everything but once you get it going it's going to sit here and it's going to radiate heat out from that glass and a hurricane lamp in and of itself once it's filled will run off of what's in its tank for 36 hours, not a problem. One tank, uh, you can get three fillings out of one of these bottles of lamp oil per tank. So you're looking at, at uh, three days per lamp. Or, no, you're looking at uh, one, two, four days per lamp at around 36 hours a tank. And they do serve dual purpose. Um, you turn them up a little bit, and as long as you ain't got no smoke, you got light to read by, or play games by, or it, all sorts of things. Turn it down, and like I say, it'll. It's got, starting to get a little hot. The the glass heats up and radiates heat keeping you warm. Third, take this off and you set you up a little tripod around it. Um, I like my uh, strainer tri tripod. It's a uh, steel. And you can set a, a pan above this and cook on it. So, for everyone who's freaking out and wanting to get these go out and buy a whole bunch of tea light, light uh, candles and whatnot. I suggest instead you go out and you get yourself a, a quality hurricane lamp that'll last you a lot longer. Anyway, this here's a, a handy redneck. I'll talk to y'all later.